SimSync is a Capita Sims accredited piece of software that automatically keeps school data in Sims synchronised with the Alfie Cloud. To turn it on, I select Tools, Setups, Data Change Management. I enable Tracking Control by selecting On and clicking on Save. For more information on Tracking Control, please contact your Sims team. SimSync requires certain permissions to run, so it is best to create an account from scratch. I need to be logged into Sims with a System Manager account. I select Focus, System Manager, Manage Users, and click New. Once I have entered the basic details, I click Continue. A new Sims account will be created. I make a note of the username and password, as I will need these later. Under the section Groups, I click on Add and select Assessment Coordinator Curricular Manager School Administrator Third Party Reporting TP Super User I click Save and then Log Out. I then log back into Sims using the username and password I have just created. This is important as it activates the account. Every Alfie account needs to have an email address so that we can send password resets and information in regards to updates and new features. I select Focus, Person, Staff to display the employee details page and search for an existing staff member to display their details. If there is no school domain email address present, I click on New and enter the school email address and set the location to Work and main to yes. Download from downloads.alfiecloud.com forward slash sims hyphen sync dot zip and install. You must install sims sync to the same machine as your sims.net installation. I launch SimSync and click on the Proxy Settings tab. I click on Test. If it is not successful, then I may need to put my settings in manually. I go to the Schools tab and click Add. I first need to enter my Sims details. I click Auto Detect to pull in the Sims server and database. I then put in the Sims username and password of the account I just created and go to the Alfie Account tab. I put my Alfie username, which is the IT email address supplied at the time of sign up, and the password I received via email. I can request a new password by clicking on Reset Password. I click Auto Detect to get the LA and DCSF numbers followed by Select School. Lastly, I click Validate All and then OK. If I don't have a green circle, then I need to go to Support alfiecloud.com for more information. I go to the Schedule tab and click on Run Now. I can view the progress of the sync by going to the Logs tab, selecting the Alfie main log and clicking Refresh every few minutes. A first sync can take up to 10 to 15 minutes depending on the size of my school. But when I see tasks completed for my school name, I know it is done. If you have any errors in the log, then just save to disk and send to support at alfiesoft.com. I return to the schedule tab. I can choose a time in the run daily drop down. I fill in the Windows username and password with an admin account and click on start. 
SimSync is now all set up to run each night and keep my data synchronised.